Maria. Eastern side of the field. Comes back there now through Neen. He gives it away to Weidler. He beat one, beat two, still going Weidler. Trying to get away from Seymour, but Muller was over the top to bring him into the ground. You'll play the football back now, about 20 metres out from the Dolphins' goal line. They'll go short. This is Ritter. He's over. Second try of the afternoon for the Tigers. Guy met them. Marshall Barker, Benjamin Hagen, Shane Wadwell, Daniel Ritter, and the interchange bench for the Tigers, Scott Blanch, Lachlan Cameron, Justin Apthorpe. He's 10 metres away from the Dolphins' goal line. They're leading by 12 points to nil. This is Keen out the back to Griffiths. Overlap out wide if they can use their winger in Duncan. Duncan will flick the pass back on the inside. Goes straight to the Dolphins, and they counter-attack, and now they're cut down about 15 metres out from their own goal line. In between the fullback and the winger, the ball goes, goes down to Gore. Got a bit of space in front of him. And playing it there is Joel Harrison from Scone. So here come the Tigers, 10 metres out, back through Barker. Siren, some sort of siren goes in the background. Maybe not the rugby league siren, I don't think it's a ship siren. Back then out of Neen, he goes himself. We're just about on the netball courts as well. Back then out of the right-hand side of the field, the Tigers now through Griffiths. He finds Smith. He sees the gap. He'll score here if he can get it down. He does get it down. The Tigers, they've pretty much got the nucleus of last year's pack. And they've got some very talented outside backs, as we've seen from their first four tries of the, the afternoon. As we now go out wide to the edge of the field. This is their backs we're speaking of. This is Duncan. He'll kick. Flying through his crouch. The Dolphins won't get it. Crouch does. And Crouch from Greta Brankston. He scores underneath the post. Well, we just said they've got electrifying wingers when they can get it out wide. What a first 40 minutes of rugby league for them. Can they go on with it? It's all in front of the Dolphins. Referee. Craig Jones from the Group 7 says time back underway. As we see now, the North Coast Dolphins, first use of the football. And this is Kirkland. Goes away from the Dolphins line. 24 points to nil. The Tigers on a rampage. Once more in the corner they go. And he's dropped down 10 metres away from the Tigers' goal line. Quick play the ball. Cutmore's with it again. This is Clark trying to... Extend his arm. Back to Miller. They go short. They'll barge. They'll bash their way over for their first try of the match. Sometimes you've got to expect it when it's most unexpected. There's a chance here. There's a gap. There's a hole. There's a try. They go over for their second of the match. 30 points to 10 on the CRL scoreboard with a kick to come. Met them slowly to his feet. The Inverell Hawk player. Wadwell. Goes himself. Beats Maguire. Offloading as well. Play on. Back to Neen. Overlap out wide. Smith has got it. Smith has been wrestled into the ground. A few weeks ago as well. Back to it comes to Clark. He now finds Maguire. A metre out. Clark again. Cudmore. There's the kick. Where's the chase? He's got it back. He'll score. What a great individual try by Michael Henry. A few bucks to make themselves into the ground and supporting our country rugby league competition as the Dolphins go down the sideline. This is Cudmore. He pins the ears back. He kicks for his winger in Seymour. And Seymour scores what will possibly be the last try of the match. A consolation try to the Dolphins of this break. So full time, 30 points to 20, the Tigers over the Dolphins.